okay that's so fake like hmm. guys welcome back to my channel okay um if this is your first time tuning in then um you're highly welcome thank you for clicking on my video link today is not hmm, today is not what i planned it to be at all but we are moving still nonetheless okay today's video to the library um yeah just to see what um library looks like a library looks like here in my city in china personally i'm very excited i've always wanted to visit you know a proper proper library okay i'm not throwing shades or anything but yeah so i was like okay let me just take you guys along with me so you guys can actually see what um a library looks like in my city okay which is guizhou china okay so if that's something you feel like you'd want to see come along okay okay So we have to scan something first before we enter. When you scan this, it's meant to turn green. Then you're going to show to them to show that you're healthy and you don't have corona. What the library looks like, guys. It's like actually a library strobe bookstore. So you can see there are people reading. And And your books as well, so yeah, it looks so pretty.
Okay guys, um, so this is what the library looks like. Um, I'm going to show you guys around for you to you know, see what um, different sections. Obviously, I don't think I can go every single, like I can, I can go to every single aisle just because I think there are some places where people are reading and those places are like extra quiet. And the library also seems really big as well. So I'd also want to, you know, look around myself. And yeah, so I'm just going to show you guys a bit and then start looking around myself, okay? So, yeah. Religion, philosophy. World history series. World history. Uh, so this area is um, Guizhou minority culture and Guizhou is uh, my current city in China so this whole area is for the culture and all the ethnic groups and stuff like that so I told you guys this is both a library and a bookshop as well so I've already showed you guys where um, people read and yeah so these are books where you can buy and borrow as well so. That's basically, you can see the shop attendants attending to people. Um, There's also like a small stationary area right here for your uh, stationaries, pens, cleaners, and stuff like that. I don't know, this place is just so pretty. I can't wait to actually calm down and look at it. It gives me this vibe of um like i'm inside space i don't know you can see all the attendants are wearing their face masks oh wow 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 so beautiful so pretty this is um china hong kong and taiwan literature all the books are in chinese all the books are in Chinese, yeah. All the books I've seen so far. Um, but I think they're actually English books like um, Harry Potter and all these popular books that, you know, they kind of translate to um, Chinese for them to, for them to read. So this is an, oh wow, this is an hour where people are studying. Wow. Guys, let's go up.
something that I can resonate with a book that I actually know guys can you see this pride and prejudice okay I feel like uh, everybody not everybody shall, but most people should know this book we read it uh, when we were younger so it's translated to Chinese as you guys can see and um, another one I can see here is um, Oliver Twist guys Oliver Twist the Chinese version okay <laughs> let me open it for you guys to see what it looks like so you can see it's literally translated into Chinese for them to read and yeah everybody should know Oliver Twist come on guys like you should know Oliver Twist at least the movie yeah Oliver Twist I want some more Charles Dickens <laughs> all these books this reminds me of my I think these are law books so this reminds me of my mother's law books okay mother if you're watching this reminds me a lot of you and law and no Charles that way has to do with no, um, science so, right so it's self learning whatever yeah oh. so let me show you guys something can you guys see where the books how the books are hung can you guys let me show you guys wait can you guys see so it's like from down and then it keeps going and it keeps going and it curves so I don't even know how like I can't reach <laughs> That particular i don't know how they actually they, there's a ladder somewhere i'm guessing for them to reach all those books on the top so yeah this library is just so beautiful to be very honest so so guys um i'm probably going to be ending this vlog here okay. i feel like i've shown you guys every let me let me take off my glasses i feel like i've shown you guys almost everything there is to show um yeah so that's it i hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and i was able to you know give you guys kind of like an insight of what a library looks like here in china so yeah if you enjoyed watching this video please don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up click the like button and also leave your comments down below okay if you have any um anything you feel like you'd want to see about china okay or me or whatever or just basically any video idea i'm open to suggestions okay so you can leave it down below in the comment section i don't know why i'm even so happy right now because my friend and i actually we had a really shitty day but i'm trying not to let things that i have no control over you know have so much um impact and effect on me so i'm just trying to be happy okay so yeah that's basically it thank you for watching me that's if you watch to the end because i know some people would have left by now but it's okay it's all right okay thank you guys so much so until next time bye